Hey everybody, this is Shauna from Shauna's Dream Life. I'm going to be doing a Dollar Tree haul today and I found some really cool spring stuff. I, I have been waiting for like two weeks now uh, just because I haven't been shopping as much. I've had a lot of work to do and then my son was sick. So I've been waiting patiently to be able to do this video. So I want to show you my absolute favorite item first. How stinking cute is this? A butterfly riding a bicycle and and look, the flowers turn. Is that not cute? They had, um, let's see, what else did they have? They had a butterfly. They had a turtle. They had a ladybug. They had just so many different things. That were these little wind chimes. Not all of them were riding a bike, but they had some, like the turtle, and I believe the frog, and the, I want to say the frog was, but I may be wrong, um, and the ladybug was riding a bike. The rest of them were just, um, they were just like posed or whatever with the single bell, but I saw this and I was blown away. It was, it was everything that I was looking for. I walked out of that Dollar Tree happy just because of this. So I did just get one. Now I'm wishing that I had gotten a couple, but I didn't want to overdo my porch this spring because I do have a lot of flowers and stuff that I want to try to put out. So I got this. Um, the next thing, keeping with the same kind of theme, is I picked up these solar owl lights where the eyes glow. They're so cute. I picked up two of these. Let me see the sticker on the bottom. I just got to peel that off. Um, but these work inside too. I wasn't sure whether or not they were. And I couldn't make up my mind whether or not I wanted to get one or two. And I went to set it down on the shelf. And the eyes started glowing from where... I guess the overhead lights in the store, but I did get two of these. I don't know if I want to put these, part of me wants to put them on my, like my windowsill outside. Um, but then I don't know, part of me kind of wants to put them inside too, cause they're so sweet, but I'll probably end up putting them on the porch. I mean, so I got these, they had, um, the only other design of these that I saw were frogs. And I've done frogs for so many years that now I'm kind of switching things up. So I got the owls of these. <clears throat> the next thing that I picked up, just go ahead and keep with the outside theme. I picked up one of these hanging baskets because like I said, I do have, um, I want to put a bunch of flowers out this year. Last year, I put a couple out just to kind of see how it was going to go. And they done really well. So, I do want to try to add to those and put some more out. So, I just got one of these um, because I think I want to put like a fern or something that can come down over top. The next item that I picked up was just a paper towel holder. Um, this one, I, I have a, a really nice paper towel holder that I actually use. So this honestly isn't going to be used as a paper towel holder. <clears throat> I have a D and D um, craft that I want to try to make with this. I think so. Yeah, I really, yeah. I'm not going to give too much away about that, but I got one of these. Um, sticking with D&D. <clears throat> they had zombie figurines. 
zombie figurines. Ow! These little things were so amazing to me. And I was like, these, a whole package for a dollar. And we're always, I mean, we always use figurines and things like that for our Dungeons and Dragons, our D&D campaign. And so my husband was really excited about finding me finding these. Um, now he has more things to kill us with because he's the DM. So <laughs> I did pick these up and um, it comes with <clears throat> 14 pieces. It took me forever to see it. Um, but it comes with different ones. And then it comes with like a, a headstone. It comes with two headstones, it looks like. And then it has some females and it has some male zombies. And it even has a little zombie dog. A zombie dog. I'm sorry about all the plastic rattling. A zombie dog. So cute. Who would have ever thought that I would be getting excited over zombie toys? But like I said, my husband was really excited that we found these. And we actually just finished playing um, D&D Saturday. We had um, our group get together. And he was like, you have to do this video before Saturday. Sorry, sweetie. Um, I had to wait. Um... So, he'll be excited to be able to use these for the next campaign. Or the next session, I guess. Um, the... I just picked up a bag of jelly beans. I don't really eat a lot of jelly beans. It's not one of my favorite candies. But around this time, I always... I don't know. I get that taste. Like, I really want to have jelly beans. I want, uh, I want to... Uh, sugar out. So I just picked up one bag because, like I said, it's not my favorite, but at the same time, when you're really, really craving something, so why not pay a buck for a big bag of jelly beans? So I picked that up. Um, we are actually going to be traveling here soon um, in June. Uh, you guys are going to get sick of me hearing me talk about it, but my daughter is going off to college. So I picked up some more stickers. <clears throat> and then I realized, I'm pretty sure I already have these. Put back for dedication. I'm almost positive that I do. But that's okay because, I mean, it says welcome to paradise. I can always use them. Um, I did pick up some more glue sticks because I am a crafter and I'm always out of glue sticks for my hot glue gun. So I got that. I picked up these for my granddaughter. And I just thought these were super, super sweet. They're little unicorns. I don't know if you guys can see these or not. I really hope you can. Um, the pink one is apple scented lip gloss and the purple one is grape scented. So let's just open that up and see. I've never seen these before. Um, I've been, like I said, I've been really, really busy the last couple of weeks. So I haven't even been watching my normal videos that I watch. Um, oh, that smells really, really good. Definitely grape. Um, but I haven't seen anybody else haul these, but I've missed videos the last couple of weeks. So someone may have. Um, so, but I was excited because I found these. And pardon my voice or if I start to cough or anything, my allergies this year have been worse than they have ever been. I, I take medicine for my allergies and just nothing seems to be helping with this 
sinus thing. Oh, that one smells really good too. Definitely apple. So I got her that. And I thought these would be cute. Once she uses all of the lip gloss out of it, you can like hot glue it to a little jar or a little box or something. And she can have like a little trinket box with unicorns. So I picked her up those. Um, the Oh, before I get into my planner stuff, the I found these at the Dollar Tree. And they've had them before, but I have really been wanting a dice cup to kind of help because sometimes characters have to roll like quite a few dice at the same time. And I also wanted something that I could store my dice in um, that I use all the time, like for that particular game or whatever. So I bought this and I think I'm going to do something with it and make it into a dice cup. I just don't know how yet. So when I figure that out, y'all guys will see it. Um, just keeping along with the crafting stuff, um, just to get that done. I picked up two things. Well, technically five things of ribbon. Um, I got the blue and I guess it's like a pinkish, or it's more like a peach with the arrows on it. I don't know if you guys can see that. And then I got three things of lace. And the lace, well, all of it comes with three yards, um, and it is five eighth, five eighths inch by nine foot. Um, and this is lace ribbon, and this is the gross grain ribbon, 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 ribbon. I want to make like a bohemian, um, like a bohemian dream catcher. I picked these up because I think these would be really, really cute in that project. And I got something else for that, but you'll see that in the next video because as soon as I finish this one, I'm actually going to go ahead and since it's my day off, film my next video as well. So that's why I'm gonna be dressed the same. Um, and it's going to be a Mighty Dollar Haul because that's where I found some more stuff for this project. So stay tuned for that. That one will be coming out soon. Right after, or well, Friday, I think. Um, the last things that I got from the Dollar Tree, um, I got a box of tissues. Like I said, my allergies. Um, is <sighs> washi. Washi makes me happy. So I just picked up um, a plaid washi. I picked up one that has, uh, what are they called? Macaroons on it. I thought that was really cute. I picked up one that was black and it has stars on it. This one gave me like a rainbow bright 80s vibe. I don't know, but I really liked this one. And this one, which is has a black background, and it has polka dots, different colored polka dots all over it. So I picked those up for my planner, and I I was happy with them. I was ha I didn't get a lot this time. Um, my Dollar Trees they they sometimes they have a lot of stuff and sometimes they don't. It actually took me like I said it's been two weeks almost that I've been holding on to some of this stuff. I get a little bit as I go, um, a little bit, you know, they'll come out with something. But the last time that I was there, which was yesterday, day before yesterday, um, they were stocking all of their spring stuff up front. So I will try to get back over there this week and see what else they've got put out. So that's it for this Dollar Tree haul. 
I really appreciate you guys watching. And if you liked this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. That way you don't miss any of my videos. And if you hit that bell icon, you actually get notified when my next one comes out. So the next one should be a Mighty Dollar haul that I'm fixing to record. So you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day. And I hope to see you all again. Bye.